there's fish in my hands. So, um, <clears throat> I want to talk about Nightmare on Elm Street, Friday the 13th, and the Michael Myers series. And we can throw in Leatherface and the remakes and how miserably bad they were. Um, I guess we'll start off with Friday the 13th, which was, uh, you know, a complete joke. You know, um, what is Michael Bay thinking? Like, I know he didn't direct it or anything, but he was pr producing, I believe, or executive producer. You've got so much money. Why wouldn't you invest in somebody like Tom Savini, like, real makeup? Because for me, honestly, as a filmmaker... The CGI just is just doesn't cut it, especially for really close shots. It just doesn't cut it. And, you know, you want to give people that, ah, and it just didn't do it. Uh, for instance, in the, <clears throat> excuse me, in the intro to um, Friday the 13th, he runs up, and uh, right before the title kicks in, Jason does this gallop and takes the, the machete and comes down on this kid's head. At first, when I saw him start to gallop, I'm like, holy crap, like, <clears throat> I never thought seeing Jason gallop would actually work. And it did. I was like, oh my god, this is amazing. Like, I can't, like, this is really, I can't believe this is even working. And <clears throat> to my disappointment, the machete comes down and just cuts this far into his head. And it looks really fake and bad. It just looks terrible. It just took you totally out of it. And I'm sitting there, I'm like, wait a minute. He just had his arm, like, fully extended back, came down. This guy is huge. He cuts into here. If I would have directed a Friday the 13th, which one day I hope to do, but why don't you just do 11? Friday the 13th is 11. Why do we gotta reboot the series? Again, this comes back to remakes and making money and, and shit. If you wanna reboot it, damn, do something like awesome. This could, this had <clears throat> potential to be good. And it failed. So what I would have done actually for that was I would have had the machete come through his head, cut clear through his head, and probably gotten caught in his collarbone. That's what I would have done. That would have been a great intro to Friday the 13th. And um, it sucked. And the rest of the movie was just trash. I couldn't stand it. It was terrible. So much CGI. It's just... What is your favorite Friday the 13th? I'd like to know. What is your favorite? I'd have to say, like... If I had to pick three of them... <laughs> it's, I would have to pick three, four, and eight. It would probably be my, my, like... Favorite, favorite ones and um, yeah I'll save that for another uh, vlog so let's move on to A Nightmare on Elm Street another one which did not need a remake whatsoever or a reboot I mean you know both of these series you could make reboots just uh, just the way they did it was just terrible and Nightmare on Elm Street which I barely remember one, from being such a bad movie, and two, uh, just, it's just so bad. Uh, positive things in Nightmare on Elm Street was, um, the set was very rich, uh, design was nice, um, it was good. Um, I thought Freddy Cougar's new look was absolutely terrible. 
really bad choice. And, um, I mean, it just looked terrible. He looked... Let's wipe it all off the screen. There we go. It looked terrible. It wasn't scary. It looked just... Didn't look scary. Let's I'll just do it like that. And Jackie, you you did your best trying to be Freddy Cougar, but you'll never be Robert England. And he did try. I have to give him credit. Granted, it was Rorschach and Freddy Cougar's skin. Um, <clears throat> he tried. I I have to give him credit for trying, but. You know, maybe you folks can tell me, because I can't... I think I read s something about it before, and I just... Uh, I don't remember if Robert England... If they even approached Robert England about it or not. Let me know, because I don't remember offhand. And um, to me, uh, having Robert England is essential... For Nightmare on Elm Street, I mean, how I mean the laugh, the, er, I mean everything that made Fred Cougar, Fred Cougar. It's like Harrison Ford being Indiana Jones. I mean, so that movie was real bad. Um, moving on to Michael Myers, uh, Halloween, um, Halloween, the Rob Zombie ones we're talking about here. I guess I'll, I'll say what some of my favorite uh, Halloweens were. It's actually 1, 2, um, and 6. I think the last one was Loomis in it. Um, the other ones I enjoyed, like I enjoyed 1, 2, 4, uh, 5, and 6. Um, they were all fun, they, you know, but... <clears throat> And let me know which ones you hated or liked. I'm going to probably talk about it again. But, um... The Rob Zombie one, which, you know... I really love the shot composition in it. There was some really cool stuff uh, um, in it. But it just... You know... In the first movie, you learn so much. You don't know anything about Michael Myers... And every time you run into Loomis, you learn more and more and more about Michael every time. And it's just great. It's just a great unfolding character and learning more. And I thought that was just really awesome. And in Rob Zombies, oh, where are the fish? In Rob Zombies, he, um, Michael Myers talks. In the first, like, five minutes, he's talked more than he has in any, like, the eight films or seven film. No, is it eight? I don't even... Uh, H2O, wow, it was a nightmare. Um, and then the second one... It should just kept going with the hospital thing, honestly. I was enjoying that. And then, as soon as the, the character woke up, it was just... Like, went straight... Downhill. Uh, I thought I thought maybe the fish would come back, <laughs> but I I didn't like Rob Zombies. I didn't think it was that scary. I did like the shot composition. I thought the music was alright. It wasn't as good as Carpenters. Um, I will say one thing about H Halloween. And uh, oh, and M Malcolm McDowell, you tried, you tried, but you're not Donald Plus. <laughs> um, It's better than Nightmare on Elm Street. It may be better than Jason. Um, and then Texas Chainsaw Massacre was just... Uh, I haven't seen the new one in... I don't know how long. And... It was bad. It was really bad. I didn't even think there was anything scary about it. I, I, that's all I can sum that one up is... is I didn't think it was scary whatsoever so you want to see the fish um I didn't think it was scary at all <laughs> oh my god uh yeah it's, it's, it's terrible it's terrible
terrible film that I think they made two of those something I think recently told me about them making two of them and I was like what they made two of those movies holy crap <laughs> oh what a joke leave your comments leave your comments let me know what you guys uh, what you guys think all right Gotta go.